allow themselves the ability to get into a good spot to go for the Diffuse, but it's just well read here by Team Heretics. And I think there's a little bit of extra space for Voot to Waru, but against Gen G, they, it felt a little bit more reserved on this map. So, oh my god, and Autumn, you absolute monster! Oh, the reservations! All being disregarded now. Autumn just destroys them. Understanding where the open space is being given and taking advantage of it. And I mean, this is just Woot never really leaving his perch. I, he never had to. Nope. Never any util or anything like that to try to displace him. Just trying to go for these Eagle Peaks. So this is something that when I was casting FPX versus Gen G, that Berlin the chance to show that he can find the adjustments himself mid round yeah. here to dial up something. Uh, yeah, I mean, Berlin has been beautiful on the fly. He's been beautiful creatively this tournament. Yeah, he has. But I, I, I think in what I've watched from FPX, are they going to be able to find that unbelievable comeback? That's the real question. I mean, Autumn's been great for them, especially in clutch moments in this event. It's nice to see him step up here. I guess, frankly, the two rounds they won were were him. Were him. Yeah. And the 3K at the beginning. No fatal exchange on the other side, but enough to make you think twice about it. Down to 54 HP. The snap on Wood is perfect, and he's the one that's got to go down. He was a terror in the previous map, and it seems like life is taking over where Wood left off. A massive start for FPX. He's got four, and at this point, you got to go for it. They want it. Issue upgrading weapon. And they're trying to take these fights. They can, they can get these ones if things go their way. It's a shot at it. A one for one. Boo pushing forward. Lysor weak. It's planted for him though. Cover going out. The first smoke down. The taps oh. come through for Lysor. He gets his third. It's FPX get to eight. He's been so good in these clutch moments for FPX in this tournament. A four v four now. They're committing. The ults. Lysor is rotated over. Life on the swing. Talk about having a plan and doing it no matter what. It's reckless, but it works. Traded in kind. Revenge so, so sweet. Long and Heretics are positioning this so well. They were glad to give up the space, but they're going to have to deal with a bit of the utility. Ooh. Berlin's gotten it to half. They have to check it three quarters of the way. 80% now, and it's stopped. Finally, Elias are on the other side of the smoke. 20 HP, the spam not connecting. Pad attack plays it beautifully. There is not enough time. He's going to get the kill, but is he going to get the defuse? Holy smokes, he did! Oh, I thought, I thought it was over. But the MasterCard thrifty for FPX to get on the board. Finally different path he doesn't go under two are they going to be expecting it meanwhile chaos on the site as each kill is traded one for one berlin in 1v2 he's been spotted oh, no. they know where he is but he's gotten his one now the cove on the swing berlin is close to it and it's another clutch another set of ot they knew he was coming and he still wins it 35 kills for the duelist. Unbelievable. What a day he's having. If Heretics comes through, it's going to be in a big part because of the way Woot has stepped up on these duelists. I love it.